Hey everybody, it's uh, Robbie here again. I just thought I'd make another video, same day. Uh, Wednesday the 5th. Anyway, uh, pressing the bob, framing in them drops all morning and tacking the heads in and they got this one and another one done, so I just thought I'd uh, make a little short video, set it up, show you what it looks like. You know, I know my first video said, you know, it's hard to explain, but get the heads all together, they got the fishing head in it. <laughs> this is called a three ball round trap, it's uh, 46 inches long, it's a uh, 24 inches from here to here, but it's 21 in the center, so we always call them 21 in, uh, inch center traps, right? Got the hoop, two hoops, offset, lobster, you know, comes in. There's the bait spear, put the bait on there, lobster's, you know. Hoop here, and there's a hoop. There's the bait spear. What we use is a piece of bungee cord, cut a little piece of, uh, it's water line, an uh, inch and a half probably, water line, so you put your bait on there, on the bait spear, and then you just take this, and what we used to use was old car, or not old, you just go into Canadian Tire, 14 bucks, 15 bucks, get a 13 inch uh, car tire tube, cut it up, but the shit rots, eh? after a year or two so this is a and then you're always trying it gets down in there and you're baiting and you're always chasing the damn thing around so that there's pretty good rig it's you know grab it easy boom slide it on over so you put your bait there and like I said the lobsters come in and they all go out they crawl all around 80 percent of them go back out right but you get some there maybe a lobster comes in and a bigger one comes in and it's the bigger ones are territorial so you know maybe scares the, the smaller one in and he comes in and this is a easy out like he thinks he's getting out of the trap but he gets in here in between them two heads so he comes in and hangs out you know crawls around he can't find his way out and uh, so on so on right we start fishing at five in the morning usually Finish up at two or three in the afternoon. Lobsters don't. Lobsters are kind of a nighttime creature. So once it starts getting dark, and you know through the night, early in the morning, yeah, they will trap through the daytime. You know, certain times too, with the uh, the wind and the weather, the right conditions, they'll trap in the daytime. We've all gear back. That it's only been on the bottom for three or four year, four hours. We had to haul it back for whatever reason. And, you know, you start getting two or three lobsters in the trap, especially, you know, big markets are trapping, right? So, I think a majority of the time, the lobsters up here eating and hanging out, and when you go to haul your trap, the force of the water shoves them in the back end, right? So, them hoops are uh, five and a half, six inch hoops. So, like I said, that's kind of what a lobster be looking at. Trap's pretty bright, eh, because it's new, but. Like I said, once it's a year or two old and out in the sun, it'll darken up like any any wood, right? Sometimes new traps don't fish good because they're they're bright like this, and and uh, you know the the wood will foam bubble. There's air in the wood, especially soft wood, I find. So anyway, that's kind of the trap. It's coming together, and I'll make another video when we get the door on it and the escape. So. Anyway, I just thought I'd trap uh, building part three. Right on, thanks.